Hi, today I want to talk about accusative case of direction. Accusative case of direction is used with the nouns which answer the question where to. In Ukrainian it's kudi. Where to? Kudi. And it's also used with the prepositions before them, like v, generally or literally meaning in, or u, also meaning in, also na, meaning on, literally. V is used when the following noun begins with a vowel, and u when the following noun begins from a consonant. But the use of na, also u and v, is not regulated by the grammar of Ukrainian language. It is a set of expressions, and they are to be memorized. Let's check the most common of them. To demonstrate the examples more clearly, I chose two questions with the verbs of motion. First is, kudi vi idete? Where are you going? On foot. Kudi vi idete? The second is, kudi vi idete? Where are you going? By a vehicle. Kudi vi idete? Na more? To the sea. Na more? Na richku? To the river, na richku, na vystavku, to the exhibition, na vystavku, na stadion, to the stadium, na stadion, na koncert, to the concert, na koncert, na pláž, to the beach, na pláž, na excursion, to the excursion. Na excursio. Na bazar. To the market. To the bazar. Na bazar. Na robotu. To work. Na robotu. Now, let's see the examples with V and U. V Ukrainu. To Ukraine. V Ukrainu. U Karpate. To the Carpathian Mountains. U Karpate, U Mahazin, to the shop, U Mahazin, U Kino, to the cinema, U Kino, U Theater, to the theater, U Theater, V Office, to the office. V office. U bassein. To the pool. U bassein. U park. To the park. U park. U hori. To the mountains. U hori. U musei. To the museum. U musei. Now I want to give you the exercise to work on. I will kindly ask you to translate from Ukrainian to English or to your native language and see how these set expressions are being used. Куди він іде? Він іде на стадіон. Сьогодні я іду у музей, а Джон іде на стадіон. Вони їдуть на вокзал, а Петро йде на виставку. Моя сестра їде у Карпати, а туристи йдуть на екскурсію. So, try to translate this simple exercise. And if you have any questions or comments or wishes, feel free to write me.